high alone. <clears throat> I'm gonna try my best to do um, a gentle voice uh, recording while I build in the Sims, which could get frustrating because I'm kind of an idiot. Um, Sorry. <laughs> uh, where's my cord? Uh, it's not my cord. Oh well. Uh, I think it'll be fine. Uh, I'm gonna be using my phone to uh, get. God, where is it? <laughs> to get um, an idea of what I'm doing for. I'm gonna double check that my, my volume on the ethereal music isn't louder than my voice. Because I want you guys to be able to hear me with my new mic. Which is very, very strong, apparently. I learned that. No. No, no ads. No ads. No ads. Don't do this to me. Don't do this to me. No League of Legends. Don't do this to me. It's a gentle voice video. Don't do this to me. <laughs> oh, what's it called? I wanted to do a blueprint because I'm kind of stupid <laughs> and when I have a blueprint I know what I'm doing and when I know what I'm doing I'm not stupid so we're gonna try and do that today um this is probably one of the only uh one of the uh sims builds that I'm gonna be using my voice in just because I got a new headset and my speakers are different now. Uh, and I want to try to see if... <clears throat> Sorry. If people are going to like uh, my ASMRs. Which is like literally the, the, the next thing I want to start doing. Um, once I get a decent microphone that isn't a part of a headset. <laughs> It's just kind of lame, but it's fine. Um, also, the audio is not crapping out, and I don't have to wrap my uh, wire around a hair tie in order to <laughs> hear what's coming out of my computer, which is nice. Um, I do not like my gentle voice sometimes because it's a little more high-pitched than uh, I would prefer but I know that some people will actually enjoy my voice and that I need to be open to that and be understanding that just because I'm my own worst critic doesn't mean that other people aren't going to enjoy my content, my voice and Yada yada yada, as I plapper on because my my game is gonna be a little slow, uh, which is fine. Like we we all know that uh, that my computer is slow, and we love her for trying her best. Uh, I think we're gonna get do midtown meadows here, just because I uh, am getting used to doing builds. Um, I have not been good at builds for a really long time, and, uh, learning how to be good at builds is a good idea, if I want to be a Sims YouTuber, <coughs> so that I can do, uh, speed builds for like, like pre-record speed builds for content when I'm away from monitor for a while. Um, <sighs> I say as I have, um, god, what, um, seven videos set to, uh, drop periodically every other day. Um, I do plan on doing that regularly, 
However, I do know that uh, as soon as I am back in uni, I will struggle with that a lot. But I have a schedule that I've been working on as well. So hopefully my ADHD lets me live decently this year. Uh, and I have yet to say this year's name. I do not intend to, uh, for fear of waking the beast and ruining my luck. Because so far my luck has been going really, really well, and I don't want to jinx it, so I'm gonna knock on wood there. <laughs> Which is probably ridiculous, but no. That went back on wood. I don't have salt with me, otherwise it would have been thrown over my- wait a minute, yes I do. Nope, we're not throwing salt over my shoulder at my desk. We're not doing that, because that's ridiculous. We're not doing that. Um, I may start doing scripted uh, ASMR videos. Just to get used to my voice and back into the swing of acting so that I can get back to doing what I wanted to do uh, a little while ago, while ago, which was uh, voice acting, uh, possibly for games and uh, animations and stuff like that, because I always used to think that was really cool getting to, to voice act for stuff like that. Um, Some of my current, uh, big, what's, what's the word, uh, <laughs> inspirations, uh, heroes, whatever, uh, are voice actors, like, uh, Michael Kovach, and, uh, God. like Jonah Scott and Ben Diskin, stuff like that, which I just learned that Ben Diskin plays uh, <laughs> Bon from Seven Deadly Sins, the English dubbed version of Bon. And yes, I watch dub over sub, get over it, nobody gives a shit. Um, I honestly can watch both. I just prefer dub because I have ADHD. So, um, don't come at me about it, okay? So, I have my, uh, what is it? What is it? Blueprint? Oh, up. I have enough storage space for them. Shut up. I may need to transfer some things, but that's different. This is cute, but I've never seen this. That's lovely. Who did that? That's really cute. This is really cute, I like it. Um, but we're not doing that. <laughs> Sorry. We're gonna do, we're gonna click T and toggle over the map. You guys can probably hear my mouse louder than me, which is fine. Because some people actually like the clickies, as I call them so lovingly. <laughs> um, there are times where I will probably forget that I'm doing this with soft voice and start shouting because I get frustrated. If I do, I apologize if I'm ruining your sleep or waking you up from sleep because I'm talking so much and you have just decided to fall asleep to me. If you did, um, I appreciate that. That is a very, very big compliment to me. Uh, but if you <laughs> choose not to and you're just listening to me be a dumbass, hi, hello, uh, you are also welcome here, and I appreciate it either way. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing, and I'm gonna sing quietly, I'm already frustrated, and this is not going well. <laughs> oh god. 
I will likely laugh at myself several times throughout the making of this video because I am a dipshit and I find myself uh, unexplainably hilarious. So <laughs> I apologize in advance for that. Shut up, fam. I'm not dealing with your bullshit today. I am not building an aubergine house before you think that. And yes, I know they're not called aubergines in America, and I live in America, so I sound weird calling them aubergines, but I'm calling them an aubergine because in Sims, that's what they're called. Um, and I find aubergine funnier to say than eggplant, so <laughs> we're doing that and you're gonna live with it <laughs> if you have decided to click on this video <laughs> because I am ridiculous <laughs> my friend's foster cat is being a menace apparently which is fantastic because he's always a menace um, he's actually my cousin's cat that my friend is fostering because she's wonderful and does me large favors quite often and I'm sure that they are sick of my shit by now. <laughs> Read that right Pandora? Yes, I'm calling you out directly. Don't ask me how I know what you're thinking. I just do. <laughs> I'm being ridiculous. Let me let me live. It's fine. <clears throat> I am unsure of how long this video will go uh, because I usually record these until the build is done. But I could also just do it until I'm tired of talking like this and do a two-part episode for... God damn it. Stop. Why do you suck? <laughs> Stop it. I swear to God. No. <laughs> I will lose my ever-loving mind. This is like when Mark played I Am Bread <laughs> and he got really, really frustrated. And so, don't worry, little controller. I won't hurt you. I won't break you unless you deserve to be broken. Same goes for all of you. <laughs> I should not remember that word for word, but I do. So, uh, don't question my life choices. Because it's fine. It's fine. I promise. It's fine. And we're gonna move the rest of the living room up here. And I am going to sound ridiculous because I sound like I know what I'm doing, but I really, really don't. It's okay. You know why it's okay? Because nobody ever knows what you're doing. Especially in the middle of a global panini. It's fine. Now the question is, am I talking about the global panini, or am I talking about the fact that I don't know what I'm doing? That is up to interpretation. You decide what I'm talking about. <clears throat> I am an idiot with the power of a genius. And some may call that terrifying, others may call that gorgeous, others may say it's absolutely disgusting. I say, I'm just living my life, so shut up. <laughs> I'm an idiot. 
and I need all of you to know that. Because otherwise, this blabbering will be complete nonsense to you. Which, again, is fine, because I'm nonsense to just about everybody. But, I don't want people clicking off of this because I sound like a psycho. I need you to understand that I have been sick for three days, roughly, give or take. And, uh, I do not know for half a second what the hell I am talking about. It is okay that I do not know what I am talking about. You know why? It is okay. Because eventually I will not give enough of a shit for it to matter. Currently, I give enough of a shit for it to matter, so that is a problem, but it could be worse. <laughs> it could be worse. By a lot. My medical, my medical condition has worsened by a factor of 2.5. Am I going to be just quoting Markiplier today? Perhaps. I am not quite sure. My brain is not decided. <laughs> I'm so sorry that I am an idiot. As I have fucked the room. God. I didn't. I didn't. Listen. <sighs> listen. Okay. I, I need you to listen to me. I'm about to lose my shit. <clears throat> I did not alter my mic like, sensitivity, so I will uh, know the sensitivity of my mic as soon as this uh, video is done, which uh, unfortunately probably won't be for a while. But it's okay. <laughs> I'm so stupid. <sighs> this is a lovely house. And I have not made any mistakes. And I am a genius. I am a contract genius. For I know what I am doing. And I am not an idiot. For those of you who believe me when I say that, I appreciate it, but I, I definitely am an idiot. Especially since I didn't toggle my map back down. <sighs> to raise the house. God damn it. Anyway. Why is this a tool? Get out of here, you disgusting fuck. How dare you? How dare you exist? I'm sure there is someone out there who loved every second of that and, um, <laughs> and would love for me to do audios that are nothing but that. Quietly and gently degrading the absolute shit out of somebody, which is fine. Uh, I could probably do that, but I'm probably not going to, as it would easily get demonetized. <laughs> I need you to understand that I am the dumbest idiot to ever exist. Um, that is really all I needed you to understand, but it's still super, super funny. <laughs> Ow. I need to put wire protectors on those. Just because I do. It is okay. It is fine. Um, 
what was I? I need to put a fence around the front deck. Because that is what this blueprint calls for. <clears throat> and while I cannot necessarily match this blueprint to a T, I could definitely try. And uh, that would uh, be better than the idiocy of me doing this separately from instruction and direction. Because I. I'm an imbecile, to the highest degree. <sighs> For those of you who are laughing with me, instead of clicking off of this video, I appreciate you. And I would love for you to stay on this channel as long as you possibly can, because I am an idiot. And if you enjoy this content, it will be your favorite content for a really long time, because this is just how I am as a person. Uh, except louder, actually. So if you prefer me quiet, um, I would, if I were you, I would keep up with these specifically where I do gentle voice instead of just ethereal music and you will be just fine. And I'm sorry I've been <laughs> talking to you directly this whole time and you're probably severely uncomfortable, but it's, uh, it's gonna be okay gonna be okay, buddy. I... It's fine. We do not need a fenced-in yard. Only nerds and white women need fenced-in yards. And we are not white women. <sighs> if you are a white woman and you just got upset about that, I hope you step on your son's Lego on your way to go leave a Yelp review about my YouTube channel. <laughs> anyway. I have been high on sleep deprivation. for several days, and I sound like an idiot, so it's fine. <laughs> you just need to trust that I am doing okay. Barely concrete. Bitch, that looks like C-class. Okay. I hope eventually I become one of those YouTubers that people take clips of. And people will just take clips of my gentle voice audios and just listen to me be a complete and utter idiot for 20 to 30 minutes. Saying things that out of context would look so dumb on my part. Just because I myself am an idiot. <laughs> Anyway, why? Oh, it's basketball flooring. This is from Discovery Uni. That's fine. I thought it was from San Marcino. No, it is not. It is from San Marcino. It is from City Living. Who the hell decided green and purple? Red floorings make sense. Green, purple, and orange floorings. Blue? Two different shades of blue. Get your drunk ass out of my office if you think this is a good idea. Anyway. <laughs> I don't even remember what I was talking about. I am an idiot. And that is all you need to know about my existence as a person on this godforsaken app. The world has taken my sanity from me. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I don't know what I'm doing with my life. 
I am just trying my best. I am an idiot trying their best. That is, that is what I am. That is all you need to know that I am. Is an idiot trying to live their life. I will never understand why I am a person. at this point, which is not her. <laughs> if you don't shut your bitch ass up, play. There are people who are trying to sleep. What am I doing? Why do I control you? I've been writing too much. <laughs> <clears throat> I clicked control V instead of shift click to place the carpet properly. I am a dumbass. <sighs> I am so done with existence. And I do not think I could properly explain to you why or how long I have been done with existence. <laughs> Very few of you would understand why. <laughs> I'm talking to myself. I'm talking to myself. And a computer. And a can of... <laughs> of pineapple, of pineapple, of pipeline punch. I'm an idiot, and all of you should be well, 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 well aware of this, as I have said it 17 times throughout the course of this video. Am I slightly distracted? Yes. That is almost exactly what my kitchen floor looks like right now, with a little bit more cat throw up. So some of you have probably fallen asleep and woken back up because my dumb ass got loud somehow. <laughs> and now you are wondering why the fuck I am talking about cat moment. I own five cats. Only one of which is mine and he has run away. Um, he is a little shit, but I love him. And I miss him dearly. I would very much like him back. So if you see if you live in Iowa, and you see an orange tabby, uh, possibly with a royal blue collar with a fish tag, please, for the love of God, take him to a shelter. The shelter will find him somewhere on the internet on the seven different websites I have posted him on, and contact me and my family, and he will be home safely. All of those links are down in the description if you find him and want to return him yourself. <clears throat> um, his links are in the description of all of my Sims videos as he is a featured character in this series. Uh, except not the series where I build homes. He is just barely existing in this universe, which is fine. <clears throat> I believe this will do fine. Uh, none of my content has been doing too great, but I am not all that worried about it, as I am a very small YouTuber with very, very, very crappy internet service and very, very crappy uh, filming equipment on a laptop, of all things, who is trying her best, and we love her. Uh, she does not have a name. Go ahead and name my laptop in the comments if you would like. 
I have not called her anything other than a darling and my dear when I'm frustrated and realize that I cannot yell at inanimate objects because they will not do what I wish them to do. If I yell at them, there is no point in yelling at inanimate objects. <coughs> And I think that is something that we should all take into our lives. Idiots and inanimate objects will not do what we wish for them to do if we yell at them. They will simply persist in their stupidity or their inanimateness. Oh my god, the bisexual flag. <laughs> I am really that idiot on YouTube that just does things for the sake of doing things, and I am content with that. I don't want anything to change about that. I want to be that idiot doing things on the internet just because they can, forever. That is my intent with life, is to just do. Ask questions later and just do. <laughs> don't ask me why that room is blue, it just is. I am the greatest alive. <laughs> I'm an idiot. The duality of my existence uh, is a heavy burden. I am uh, essentially Roxanne Wolf, but as a person. As I will occasionally say, I am a god, I am the most attractive person in this existence, and I will also then, in the same breath, call myself an idiot with a brain cell number lower than my credit score, which is zero. <laughs> As I have no credit. If you were still listening to this, I, I would like to thank you, as you are the person I am talking to in the entirety of this video. And if you leave me, I will be alone for the rest of my existence. That is hopefully the loudest he'll ever get is those little um, coughs. Um, what am I? I literally only put one doorway in, and then I started in on the floors and the walls. I like I was the stupid fuck. <laughs> I'm an idiot. I I simply am an imbecile. That's fine. I am unsure of what I am doing. <sighs> this house has no semblance of organization, which is fine, because I didn't expect it to have organization. I love this door. I used it once in a Black Widow uh, run through, and I locked it for everyone except for that person. And it was a lovely playthrough because I got to be the most psychotic son of a bitch you have ever seen. And I kind of wish that I had filmed it, but I don't know that I am going to do that. Um, because I am scary. 
I scare myself. Uh, <laughs> anyway. I really don't know what I want to do with the front door. No. That was, that was atrocious. Did you see that? That is a disgusting color palette. And I will beg of you never to show it to me again. There, that will do. Lovely. Um. I don't remember what each of the bedrooms are supposed to be. I'm sure the biggest one is supposed to be the master bedroom. But I, I quite honestly do not give seven shades of fuck. <clears throat> For those of you um, who know me in real life, I will let you know now that this is the quietest you will ever hear me. Unless you were on the phone with me at an early hour. As I have just woken up, and my just woken up voice is relatively low and quiet. My poor, um... God, what's the word? <laughs> my college counselor had to hear that today. As she called me and I had just woken up. And <laughs> she answered the phone she was like, oh, did I just wake you up? Jesus. I was like, yeah, I just woke up. I, it, is, it is 10 in the morning and I just woke up. I uh, am pathetic. <laughs> I've been sick. I've been sick. I need, to, I need to give myself a bit of a break for that. The panel door. Let's go. Is it? Shit. It's, a two, it's literally a two panel door. Um, I cannot use a two panel door in the house. Inside a house. I can, however, use what appears to be a three-panel door because it is a single panel. <laughs> that is one. That is two. And that is three. Ah. Uh, I... On a frequent, ba frequent basis, would like to call myself shit for brains because I yeah, hate shit for brains. And uh this is one of those instances because I am an idiot. And I forgot how doors work. My brother just laughed in the other room when I choose to believe that he laughed at me when I know for a fact he did not. It's fine. <laughs> I do not need the validation of others to be considered funny. <laughs> I say those scene videos for the validation of others. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. It's really okay. I'm okay, I promise. I sound like an idiot when I am talking out of my ass. I cannot stress that enough. I am talking out of my ass. Um, about <laughs> most of this. But, uh, that's fine. No, it's fine. I read, no, it's fine. No, break it, break it, it's fine. <laughs> it is going to be a very rare occurrence for anyone in the universe to hear me talk at this volume level. Unless they are on my YouTube channel. And I cannot stress that enough. As I am... I am a chaos gremlin. And I need you all to be well aware of that. <clears throat> because I will never... Stop being a chaos gremlin. That is just simply 
how I am as a person. And nothing will change that. Ever. And if you wish for me to change, I will pray to every agent of chaos I am aware of that you stub your toe on the corner of every piece of furniture in your house. And your baby has just been put to sleep. I'm terrifying. And if you give me reason to be, I can be a monster. So please keep that in mind. Also keep in mind that I will never hurt any of you because I am a pansy ass little bitch. videos like this again, otherwise I will continue to talk like this, <laughs> and it will not be good for anybody, because I am an idiot and this is not necessary. Excuse me. <sighs> the sink will go there, and the stove will go here. Watch me put the sink here and the stove there, in either fucking way, it's fine. As long as there is an open airway at both sides, it will be fine. No one will care. However, in here, there will be a large window on one side, and a door, and nothing. No, on and nothing. I'm kidding. I'll leave them two windows over here that are not face level. It's fine. It is currently evening and it needs to be day in this house so that I can see. Look at this. I de definitely read that as midtown windows and I was like, yes, midtown windows, indeed. Midtown windows, indeed. <clears throat> I don't know about bracing breezes because those look like plexiglass that a white woman installed after being terrified of someone in her neighborhood. <laughs> because she yeah, she is also a pansy ass little bitch. I'm an idiot, and I need you to, I need you to understand this, because nothing I am saying right now is being processed in my brain. Nothing at all. Nothing at all. Nothing in the slightest is being processed, um, and I will likely, uh, not <laughs> be filming like this again. I may wait until I am not sick anymore to, you know what, wild foxes, why not? Because the kids would love to play with wild foxes. Ugh. Because when I am sick, I turn out to be an idiot off of medication and then later, monsters. What is this? Oh. This is bullshit. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. None of those are bullshit. I love Sims creators. They're wonderful. I, I genuinely enjoy their content more often than not. 
This is a lovely house, and I'm glad I had a plan going into this, rather than last time where I had no idea what I was doing with my life. <laughs> there needs to be furniture in the house. There needs to be furniture in the house. <laughs> but I also need to put a roof above the house. I mean, I don't necessarily need to, but it would be preferred. <laughs> it would be preferred. For anybody watching, uh, I am sorry. <laughs> no, uh, I mean, I am, but no. <laughs> You, little bitch. I swear to God. I will take away your kneecap privileges. I wonder how many people enjoy gentle threats. Because I laugh at gentle threats, I, I find them very funny. Um, but I'm wondering how many people hear gentle threats and then genuinely enjoy them. Like, like, enjoy listening to them. Just because it's fun to listen to someone threaten you when they have no idea what they're doing. Um, me especially, because, uh, again, uh, I don't know how many times I can say this, I am an idiot. <laughs> Oh god. And I'm just having fun on this app. For the sake of having fun on this app. Which is what most people used to do back in the day. Uh, it is not much the case anymore, but there are some people that are still trying to keep it that way, which I, I really appreciate them. Most of them I've been following since I was a child. I was a, I was a wee one. But uh, others are are new to my YouTube viewing experience. I love ethereal music, by the way. Um, I am a witch, and oftentimes when I am trying to get the vibes corrected, I will listen to ethereal music to keep myself from going completely and absolutely batshit insane. So, um, this is actually me being sane if you thought I was a crazy bitch this entire time. <laughs> um, This is, this is me trying to be sane. This is me vibing in my space. <laughs> if, you, if you thought I was crazy before, you should know that that is not even the half of it. As they gently vibe to the ethereal music in the background again. <laughs> I'm really just talking because I have the ability. Uh, I do not have the topics, I just have the ability. Um, which most of the time is really all you need. So, there we go. That's, that's the outside of the house. I feel like I should be talking about happy little trees, but also swearing at the same exact time, because I feel like I am the crackhead raccoon version of Billy the Painter. God, what is his name? <laughs> what did I just call him? No, his name is Bob. Bob Ross, Billy the Painter. <laughs> what the fuck did I just say? 
<laughs> Bob Ross. I feel like the rabid raccoon version of Bob Ross. Not Billy the Painter. I don't know who Billy the Painter is. I'm sure he's a lovely man. Anyway, um, yes, that is what the outside of the house looks like now. I should probably get to lighting up the house because, um, the house needs to be lit. Crunk, if you will. <laughs> uh, my, my existence is a mistake. probably should have chosen every door, but it's fine. Oh, God. Oh. I love this little stool that came with cottage living. It's adorable, and I would die for it. I am a gothic cottage core abrosexual and I live for that knowledge that I hope that others enjoy it as much as I do <laughs> this is likely going to be a child's room and I will probably be doing Creating the Sims that will live in this house in the next video, which will probably be recorded tomorrow, um, provided my other friend does not get her car back. Because I have to do friends miss with my other two friends. My, other, my only two friends. <laughs> um, as I have given everyone else in my family their Christmas gifts. I would... Uh, Kinara? What is Kinara? Forest Lights of the Menorah? Yeah, yeah, I knew that one. I don't remember what this one is. I believe it is Kwanzaa, but I could be an idiot. Someone let me know in the comments. This one is Yule. This one I know for a fact is Yule. This is also likely Yule. Anything from that is supposed to be Christmas is also Yule, but we're not going to talk about that. <laughs> um, for example, this. This is Yule. But again, we're not going to talk about that, are we? I am a little shit, and I, I don't feel bad about it at all. I am unsure of what I am doing right now. There we go. I am also unsure of... Sink here, toilet here. And again, sink here, toilet here. And for the hall, I will put an overhead light of some sort. <clears throat> Have you never heard of overhead lighting? That is a How I Met Your Mother quote. Um, so enjoy that. <laughs> I 
This is a cute light, and I will take it for this house. It is so pure. It is also very random and very horror-esque, but I, I love it. Um, I will likely also redesign the goths as I am looking at that because I have always wanted to redesign the goths for public display because first of all uh, I believe that they are the Sims version of Gomez and Morticia of the Adams in general so I would likely put Grandmama and Uncle Fester living with them as well. And God, what is her name? Cassandra. Cassandra is a uh, is definitely uh, a tamer version of Wednesday. And I do enjoy that very much. So my phone hit my desk. I have a weird candor to my voice, uh, and I'm not sure where it came from, but it's been happening throughout the video, so I'm going to just leave it, as that is the best I can come up with. This is so goddamn bright. Get out. <sighs> I did not like that at all. Ah, look. I could make a Five Nights at Freddy's build. That would be interesting. I'm not going to, because I do not have the custom content for it, but I could definitely try if I would if I wanted. I have no idea how to put custom content into my Sims world, but uh, that is okay, because I believe that if I tried, I would likely end up breaking my computer, and she works hard enough as it is. I'm not going to do that to her. Now that this, uh, this build is done, officially, like, like, the, the, the base of the house is done, I'm going to go ahead and delete the image. Oh no, oh no no no, oh no. I'm so sorry, give me just a second. You gotta love when you and your friends uh, both have crippling anxiety and abandonment issues. Uh, it's lovely. Um, I feel really bad because I will do that so so many times, both to them and they will they will do it to me and then I'll, I'll be like, no, don't do that, please. You're okay. I love you. You're fine. <sighs> I did not mean to leave them unopened for so long, I was just a little excited about my headset getting in and filming this video that I wanted to do. And now I feel like an asshole, so that's... shit. <laughs> um... God, what... what do I do now? Well, I put the furniture in, that's what I do. I wonder if I should put lighting above the bed in this bedroom because this would be likely for the teen because privacy and because I am the oldest uh, in a family of five and I was given the smallest room because I have two 
younger brothers and I struggle severely with privacy in such a small room with little to no walls uh, preventing the door from opening directly into the line of sight of the line of viewing me changing which is fantastic <sighs> anyway um, enough to of trauma trauma dumping on on main do we really trauma dump on main or does the main trauma dump on us who knows I'm still talking out of my ass because I don't know how to function as a human being. So, please be patient with me. I am finding my way back to my original topic. No, I'm not. I just I lied to you blatantly and so horribly disrespectfully. I'm so sorry. <laughs> uh, I would like... Ah, yes. And... To top off this bathroom, what in the fresh fuck? Give me the appliances. <coughs> I need the not the dishwasher. The dishwasher is for the kitchen. The laundry. The laundry washer and dryer. Ah, a vacuum. How lovely. No. Put it over here. There we go. That looks like a relatively random placement as of now, but it is literally just that I remembered that I wanted to have it. I grabbed it. This is interesting. This is a cafeteria. I see. Ah, yes juice kegs because let's encourage children to drink when they're in high school, in college. Not in, not in high school, in college. That's from uni. Oh my god. There we go. Um. Sleep and it is now cramping. This is lovely. It is fine, it is fine, it is fine, it is fine, it is fine. Ow. Dear God. Take me now. It's okay. Thank you. Ah, 
And am I sure I know what I'm doing? No, but it is going to be okay. Um, yeah. oh. so that's the dining room with the high chair because you never know when you're gonna have an infant. <clears throat> and now for the kitchen. I'm probably not done with the dining room, and I will probably go back to it here in a moment, but that is for here in a moment. <laughs> um. scenario with this house uh, it is high I will likely do that as it is one of my favorite tropes uh, <laughs> I'm not really sure why it just is um, so do not ask me why for I simply do not know it is not information that I have um, I made a very sad mistake <laughs> and put these things in the center of everything instead of where they're supposed to go. Um, counters, there we go. Work with me here, darling. Work with me. Um, I have yet to struggle That is a lie. That is a bold-faced lie. Um, I have yet to struggle <sighs> creating characters. Is what I was trying to say. Um, in The Sims, I usually have tropes or ideas um, consistently for The Sims, just because I am a, a writer. I, I'm used to writing things. Uh, I'm coming up with random ideas that I just enjoy. And I hope others enjoy, but I'm, I'm never sure. <laughs> um, For those wondering what the male life trope is, it is a very um, loving and uh, slight, slightly submissive uh, male partner. <laughs> that, um, I, I'm not sure why. They decided on male life, but um, it, it was uh, the feminists and the queers <laughs> who, who decided this. Um, I do not make up the rules. I simply abide by them. <laughs> and quite honestly, I would love to be somebody's male life. That sounds so, so appealing. kitchen, but I'm content with it. I think I'm gonna put down some, uh, I need trash. I am trash. <laughs> I need a trash can. Um, god, I hate how far away the wall is. 
I there we go <clears throat> and as it is not in the wall it should be accessible which is nice that should be fine I think I'm going to go with a different table for the dining room so that it is not This looks like it would be lovely. There we go. That is perfect. <laughs> now for the kitchen mats. Because every safe kitchen has no slip mats, my home kitchen is not safe. And I am free to admit that, but I wish we didn't. <laughs> Because many a time I have slipped in that godforsaken kitchen. These trash or treasure items need to remove themselves, as I am not interested, and I would prefer that they get out. I'm kidding, I actually like the treasure treasure items, they're just a little peculiar. And this lovely couch is from the father's time back in high school, and he refuses to get rid of it no matter how many times his wife begs him to get rid of the damn thing, because it does not match her lovely chair. Her lovely, her lovely pink chair for reading. And he insists on keeping it because it has enough room for him and the children. <laughs> and this lovely coffee table. This is going to be literally the only thing out of place in the house that is a public space. So. <clears throat> this, uh, no. <laughs> there we go. Her mother is a tyrant, but it is where they got a majority of their household items, so they kind of keep most of them just slightly out of fear because her mother is kind of insane. <laughs> and, and she will admit this, she, she does admit that her mother is kind of crazy. Um, I'm telling you all this um, as if you know who these people are, and you really don't, because this video is going to come out before they exist. Um, but I have an idea of them in my head, and I, I know what I plan on doing. Um, and they're gonna be wonderful. They're gonna be wonderful. And you're gonna love them as much as I love them. 
Except for the sun. The sun's gonna be a little shit. I can guarantee you that right now. He's gonna be the prodigy little shit. And his mother begs him to stop being such a little shit, but he cannot. As it is in his programming. Quite literally. That is a martini. That is martini lamp. That is a martini lamp, but it is base game. I love you. You make my life complete. And I need you to know this. You come in multiple colors. <laughs> anyway, I forgot to light the hallway. That's nice. Where? Where are those lights that I had? I probably already passed it once, but it's fine. Okay, now for the bedrooms. Um, like I said about the public space, spaces, um, the personal spaces are likely going to be intensely different, but uh, that is going to be okay because, of course, they are going to be intensely different. I don't like that for her, the adult teen, <laughs> the, the adult teen, did I seriously just say that? <laughs> wow, wow, I'm on a roll today, I'm on a roll today guys. Lovely little end tables. However, these end tables, there's there's four of them. And the mother um gave the other two to the to the teenage daughter thinking she was going to be the only child that they had, but that was not the case. Um <laughs> They're going to wind up either demolished or heavily painted um by the time the daughter moves out, which is lovely, because that is likely what I would do, <laughs> what I probably will do. Um, when I move out of this house, because, uh, Well, honestly, I don't know. Just because, I suppose. However... She did purchase her own wardrobe stand. Because... Her mother didn't have... A secondary wardrobe to give her. And thank God for that. But the sun has this <laughs> that was given to him by his grandmother, who again is a narcissistic asshole. <laughs> uh, the daughter has a dog. Very young dog. But she got him a large bed that sits next to her desk. Because she has trouble studying and if he gives her attention while well, she's studying, she's able to focus a little bit better. Um, her desk is small. <laughs> I, I have to 
outside of the fun's desk, however, is uh, this. Next to his bed. I kind of wish they had roll top desks, but I'm okay with the fact that they don't. Um, I enjoy clutter, but I'm really bad at clutter, so we're gonna try. I I enjoy uh, visual clutter, the actual clutter itself uh, annoys the absolute hell out of me, and having ADHD and hating clutter is a bitch. <laughs> uh -huh. Ducks. There. Oh, these. No. What is this? It is a bow. But why? Is so strange. I am um, this base game. What is this? Where did it come from? Why? Where did it come from? Why does it exist? I am so confused. When, when did that become a thing? I cannot do that. On this, I forgot about that. That's really unfortunate, but that's fine. Oh, that was my neighbors on their whatever that was. I did. I didn't like it. it. Made me very uncomfortable. I do not enjoy loud sounds that come out of nowhere like that. <laughs> Say like a cluttered sun's room. Oh, the kids' room. There we go. But the, the color is disgusting. <laughs> I messed up. them so they don't match. I really enjoy that. Um. <laughs> so they will have two smaller desks. I have, I have changed <laughs> what is happening here. I have changed what is happening here. Um. They will have two smaller desks. One is blue and the other is not. <laughs> That is not good. I will do something about that. On oh, this rat. The other has this guy, I guess. <clears throat> um, I Enjoy 
the idea of them just having tablets and the teenage daughter having bought her own laptop. Because younger ch children tend to have tend to have tablets to play on and stuff. Do homework on and blah 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 blah. One may be cat obsessed and the other may just be like the the kid. <laughs> the kid that just is. You know, like they love each other dearly and they're identical, but like they have very, very separate personalities. You know, like actual twins. <laughs> oh no, did Caster from Caster's Magic just shit on authors who don't know how to write twins? Fuck. <laughs> Yes, I did. By the way, if, you, if you're still wondering, I did, in fact. Because it's literally not that hard. They are not the same person. It's not that hard to write them differently. <laughs> I'm an asshole. And uh, if you're gonna be on my channel, you're gonna need to get used to it because I am not changing for shit. Thank you and good night. <laughs> Maybe not. Maybe they just compromised on the no. Apparently they can't compromise on the gnome, but they can compromise on something else, I'm sure. They like both enjoyed the robot head. No. They both enjoyed the CDs. They like music. They share an enjoyment of music. <clears throat> I'm unsure of how old these children are. Um, I will likely figure it out. When I do the video about them, this whole family, um, this one, this has lovely suburban uh, flipped gender roles, uh, family uh, failing to it. I mean, the double pillows, the comforter, the runner along the side there, you know. This was from his mother, because his mother is also slightly overbearing. Because I said so. Um, they don't know who that came from. I'm pretty sure that was just there when they got here. And they often uh, avoid making eye right contact with the mirror for that reason. <laughs> no. It is the correct size, but no. That is horrendous. That is even worse. I'm gonna be honest, I do not frequently do the windows or the window coverings on um, brown and red go together, I'm sure. Um, yeah, that is gonna stay there. No.
That is less wide. That is what we're looking for. That's the only window she keeps uncovered. And these kids uh, tore their co their uh, window shades off because they're little shits. <laughs> they like the outside and they prefer having the, the visible. Um, why is that the size that it is? We don't size shame on, on Caster's Magic, but I'm gonna tell you one thing. That seemed to be advertising a whole other size than it was. <laughs> I, uh... Thanks. There we go. That's what I was looking for. I don't know about the color necessarily. I'm gonna change that though. I need to be fair, I can definitely change the size of them too, but I don't really feel like it. There we go, that's better. Actually, I think I'm gonna go with. that instead, because that's closer to the chair color than the blue is. Um, <sighs> outdoors. Where are they? Doggy toy box. And of course that the male wife built to help his daughter train her dog. Because he is a good dad. And also outside <laughs> is. Are there other are are there activity stuff? <clears throat> A bike. We love that. Um, what was I doing? The wind outside my window just got really, really aggressive. So that is lovely. <laughs> um, scouting. Sure. The kids are in scouting. The kiddos are in scouting. Why not? The male wife is a den father, and he loves every second of it. This man is wonderful. I, I don't know why he made him so good. He is likely a bisexual man, or at least a he they. He is not cisgender, nor is he straight, at the very least. <laughs> and they've got a little basketball court on the side. Because I said so, oh god. That's horrid. There we go, that's better. Because... Again, because I said so. Don't ask me questions. That means you, Pandora. Don't question me. That sounded threatening, but I, I wasn't meant to be. Little swings, yes. This is... I love this family so much. There's hardly anything to do with the wife, but that's fine. Um, I'm sure she'll come together when I'm working on her. I will likely end up filming them 
their creation after this because I want to. This is lovely. I I love this. Oh, there we go. Yeah. This girl is gonna have an emotional support service dog. And he is going to be the most well trained and goodest boy in all of existence. Yeah. I think we're done. It's lovely. And I cannot wait to build the family. So. We're going to exit game. Save and exit game. And uh, I really hope you guys enjoyed this content. If you did, uh, leave a like. Um, submit my voice to people you think would like to write scripts for me. Uh, let me know what they think. In the comments or they can let me know what they think in the comments um, I will have but like my, my email is open so <laughs> I can I can receive scripts if you guys want me to start doing <sighs> scripted ASMR content that would be lovely I would love to start that for you guys um, thank you so much for watching I really hope you enjoyed this content. If you did, leave a like, comment what you liked about it, or something, whatever you feel like doing, and I will see you in the next one. Thank you all so much, and I hope you have a wonderful night. Sleep well.